Hello everybody, and welcome back to some Awakening Sky of Diamonds. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am. I hope you are making it through everything that's going on right now. Uh, things are, things are wild, man. Um, yeah, they are, um. Uh, me personally i've not had to deal with anything other than work being crazy and that's why there's been kind of a slow flux of videos um i'm not streaming as much right now i just work has been absolutely crazy um so i haven't been playing as much when i'm at home i'm tired um so but trying to keep the videos going at least one or two a week um for now um, so, but yeah, I hope you're all well. I hope you're doing great, staying safe, all that good stuff. But let's get back at this. Uh, it's actually been a couple weeks since I have played this. Uh, the last couple videos I recorded, I recorded together and got them posted when I could. Um, so, but I know we have been messing with a bit of astral sorcery. We've been missing with, missing, messing with a bit of, uh, Batania. And I logged on today after not playing for a couple weeks, and I realized we're just kind of BSing our way through all this. Not really doing anything in particular. Uh, I want to kind of change that today. Um, we have no real infrastructure. We're getting all this stuff in. No real way of doing anything with it. Uh, we're getting resources, but we still got to hand feed stuff we've got a mob farm but it's not automated um that's the kind of stuff that i want to see about working on today um we're going to start getting um i don't know about automation but i want to get mob farm upgraded i want to start collecting loot bags um uh, more or less for those uh the kappa bags uh those will give us some great stuff some of the stuff that we're going to need i want to start setting up we have I've kind of looked through the pack. Um, we don't have a real good need to set up, like, let's say, auto-crafting auto with mechanism. We don't have a real good reason to set up auto-crafting with a lot of this stuff. Um, but I still want to do it. Um, and it's stuff like that that I, we've just kind of went away from. You know, I've done a lot of work with the chickens, but I haven't really done anything with the chickens. Um, so that's all kind of stuff that I want to work on the next few... Um, next few videos. Start getting stuff set up. So, first things first. We're going to start looking... Um, not, uh, it's, uh... Can't even think this morning. Uh, we want to get into this right here tree fluid extractor this is going to be our first bit of business of getting into some machines we can actually use it to make some power um i need iron see like i said we don't i've got all this we've got all these resources and all this stuff but don't have nothing set up uh, and i want to change that so that i don't know why i just did one of those uh we need cobblestone Let's get that. Of course, that's going to suck all the power out of it. Um, I need four of these. So three more of those. Three more of those. And now we're just waiting on some stone. That's enough. So that, one, two, three, whoops. All right, there's our four. Um, let's see here. Let's get a mechanical user. Dropper, uh, one of those. 
and one of those Some item stuffs um we're going to need some fluid stuffs. I don't have any more of that. Uh, we'll take care. Actually, we can just do... Copper for this. Um, a swervo. And we're going to need... That'll be good for now. Uh, well, now let's make us... What do we have tank-wise? Um, got the black hole tank. That's way too big for what we need, at least for now. Hmm. Well, let's just make a drum. Go. Alright, now let's get all this set up. Um, builder's Wand. Uh, that is not the Builder's Wand that I want. But I guess that'll work. Um, Let's set this up. Right there. I always forget how these things place. So there's that. Let's break that out. And now we can get underneath here and work. There we go. Alrighty, so what we want to do is place our mechanical user upside down. Um, get that. We are going to need a crate. And there we go. Now we're set. So let's take that spot out right there. We'll put the crate. Insert. Extract. Always active. This set to place block. And that's all we need from down here. So now I should be able to, what do we have the most of? Let's grab a bunch of oak. Really? Should be able to place these in here. Nothing wants to work for me today. And that'll start placing. And that's going to start making latex. And I don't actually have enough servos for this. There we go.
All right, so now we've got latex going. That part of this is the easy part of this. Um, next up, we're going to need a latex processing unit. If I can spell it. Um, so we're going to need a machine frame. Do I have that? No. There we go. Another furnace. There we go. That's all we need for that. Uh, we are also going to need something to make... Um, hardened clay we can do right quick. I'll tell you what, let me get all this stuff and then I will be right back. Alright, we're back. So, should have everything we need here. Uh, latex processing unit. Uh, we will place, we can place it right next to it. Try to make this as compact as possible. Uh oh. Didn't like that. Uh, let's get a wrench. I want to break that. And break that. Put that on there. We also need to give this water. I meant to make another servo and didn't do it. What is this? Alright, we're going to try something out here. I've never used one of these before. I've never seen one of these. Um. Alright, let's get that. And I still needed the uh, servo. Alright. So now this should be good. We're getting water. We're getting that. Let's give it some power. And all is good. Now we're making the tiny dry rubber. Alright, uh, we are going to need to make some item ducks. Which means I need to make some kind of hardened glass. Um, I think lead. Well, let me do that. Alright, so I've done some looking. It doesn't look like this is going to do what I want it to do. Um, as far as the crafter goes. At least not right now. I'm going to have to do some more looking into that. Um, so we're going to do that. We're going to put a analog crafter here. Uh, we want that extract always active. Uh, we need some more blocks. I'm looking to see what's in there. We still got some trophies to get. Alright, so that insert so we're going to have to wait for that there we go that'll spread them out So now we want that. Let's set this to extract on brown. Always active. We want this to 
insert on brown. And there we go. That's going to give us our plastic. Um, auto output enabled. Let's do that. We should be able to... Is that going to... Yeah. There we go. So there we go. We've got our plastic fully automated. And don't have to worry about it. The only thing we'll have to worry about is coming back over here every once in a while. And maybe putting some wood in here but for the most part that's probably more than enough wood to take care of everything that we're going to have to do uh we did complete a couple of quests while we were at this um one for making the item duck which is going to give us some more item ducks and servos and then one for doing um the fluid ducks wasp and that uh the wasp can just go away hate wasp especially if those are the Erebus wasps which they are um, all right so all right so the next part of this is going to be me having to go spend some time up in the nether for a little while um, collecting killing some withers um, we're gonna go to our fortress that we got there close. I want to try to get us a drop of evil so we can get the mob farm going. So, I am going to do some kill. Alright, so it looks like we're going to have to do this the hard way. I went out and spent a quite a bit in the nether. Um, and there's so much stuff that spawns in there. I didn't see any pigmen. I didn't see any wither, sc or wither skeletons or anything like that. So, we're going to have to do this the hard way. Which is going to be to get us some uh, witch water. This won't take long for me to do. Hardest thing with this is I need to get mycelium, which we can get from some spores right quick. So, I'm going to start sifting some dirt. Let's see if we can't get it. And I'll be back. All right, so there is actually a quest for this. Um, it says by placing a crucible of water, all you need is a wooden barrel. I wonder, can we speed this up? We can. All right, will it give us... No. I guess it actually has to be the clay bucket. Uh, which I do have one steel. Uh, let's grab it. And we'll just put it back in here. Now, we're going to do this a wee bit different. Uh, I'm going to build us... I don't want to set up a farm with this stuff. Um, we'll use it when we need it. And that'll be it. Um, so that's one, two. It should be high enough to do this. Should be able to place the skeleton right down in there. And that's not what I wanted. And we can change it. Uh, so, but I've already worked on this. We're going to get that. Make a mob imprisonment tool and go snatch us one. Um... Which I have put our gas chicken up. So we can get a gas tier. And let's go get one. Alright, so we are running around the hunting dimension. And this is where we're going to find us one, hopefully. Uh, my yard's being mowed. So I'm going to let all that go off in the background. As soon as we get all this, I'll be back. Alright, so we are... I need to fix this. Uh, we're back. Uh, kind of weird. Um, so, I sat down when I started recording this video. I have no idea what that just was. Um, we left off 
going to the uh, 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 yeah that dimension hunting dimension to get a skeleton to make wither skeletons got all of that done um, made some wither skeleton spawn eggs do I still I don't have anything in there uh, if you don't know how to make wither skeleton spawn egg or not just wither skeleton spawn eggs period um, there is a item um, make a swab right click on a, a mob with it combine it a seed and a bucket of XP and it gives you some GM chicken feet and you can take this chicken feed let me see if we've got any chickens is there any chickens no chickens. All right. Anyways, you feed this to um, a chicken, and it'll blow up, and it will give you a spawn egg. So I killed a few of these. Matter of fact, we got the quest complete for killing those. Um, I think we actually, yeah, we completed that quest. Um got a broken spawner. I realize that these broken spawners that we are getting actually are of the mobs. Switch, there's a witch broken spawner, spiders, a spider broken spawner, all, all the above. Um, so I got that, killed a handful of them, got a drop of evil, and made us, this is just a standard everyday entry level mob farm really because uh, there's no kind of real sorting to it or anything like that um, so basically mob crushers killing them this is collecting the goo all the drops are going in these chests we're getting a ton of stuff out of them most of this stuff we're not going to need I kind of wanting to see what all we get um, before I start really filtering stuff out uh, but then I've got these going in here. I have no idea what does that. Uh, and we've now got the ability to get two kappa bags. Why did that show that we could get two and then only give us one? I don't know. Anyways, so that iridescent log, that really doesn't do a whole lot for me. So, but now we are collecting loot bags, do all that. We've got mob spawning. Like I said, we'll go through and clean all this up. Basically, the way I have this set, I have this set to ex these to extract on green, these to extract on brown. And basically, it'll pull all the loot bags out of here and place them. And then these are both. Uh, we've got quite a bit of storage for stuff here, but from the looks of it, we're not getting a whole lot of stuff of what we need. Um, trumpets. What can can we use those for? I want to. I don't even know what these. I'm just kind of curious here, right quick. Um, that. I'm going to guess that's not going to work. All right, that's fine. All right, so that's kind of where we kind of got just a quick ending on this. I just seen a Kappa bag. Um, kind of a quick ending on this. Spectre sapling, that would have been nice. Lesser magic bean and more logs. Um, didn't we get... Yeah, we've already got a specter sapling. We went through all that for nothing. Actually really like those. Uh, and then the magic bean, I believe we can plant. And that'll go up. Um, so, yeah, we've got Mob Farm going. Um, I'm going to do another video. It, it's actually been about two weeks 
since I have recorded uh, the first part of this video. Uh, life has been crazy. Um, I'll get into all that. We're going. To, I'll do another video, uh, kind of explaining where things are, what's been going on, and all that. Um, where are we at? This should be just about done with. No pod at the top. Well, that kind of sucks. Anyway, so that's kind of where we are with this. Uh, I just wanted to put an ending on this to get this video out. I know it's been a couple weeks since I had one out. Um, so, but yeah, we wound up doing what we needed to do. We got the mob farm done. I hate that not all of it was done on camera. I had an issue the day that I was recording. Um, my lawnmower man showed up. And when I sat back down, I pulled my earbuds out of my computer, and then I lost all sound. There was no sound in the in the video. There was no sound. There, I, I couldn't hear me nothing, and I didn't realize it till it was too late. Um, so that's where that's been. Anyways, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.